with KHON2 weather, Kamaka Pili. If you're still up and you're participating in Navahineo Kikai tomorrow, good luck to you. <laughs> but nonetheless, good luck to everybody who's participating. It's looking to be a beautiful day from Molokai to here on Oahu, where a lot of sunshine is expected. We aren't going to be seeing too much showers, mostly dry conditions. But the good news, probably the best news, is the winds. Now, the winds aren't going to be really light, but they're also not going to be very strong. They're going to be in this range around 10 up to 15 miles per hour. And of course, you go out deeper into the oceans conditions slightly change but everything looks to lead to a great race tomorrow hopefully that's what reality will also start to share as we go through tomorrow uh, again broadcast starts at 7 30 a.m so taking a peek at least in terms of the surf near the shores closer towards the islands three to five footers for the north one to three for the west two to four uh, for the south, one to three also for the east-facing shores across all the islands. Now, as we're stepping out of September, stepping into October, we're also going into this transition in a Hawaiian calendar to a different season. We're stepping out of our cow season, the dry season, stepping into ho'oilo, or our wet season. And we're already starting to see some slight changes that is uh, showing that uh, that change and, and the change of the trend. We're starting to see the first cold front system, more uh, winter storm systems that come in from the west. Well, fortunately, we're not going to be seeing showers from this. It's really just going to be disrupting our winds. So we've been having some moderate to locally breezy winds. That's going to start to ease off just a bit as we get in through tomorrow and into the new week. So looking at our shower activity tomorrow morning throughout uh, Sunday into Monday, it's really going to be the greatest chance of showers during the uh, later evening into the early morning hours and we're really expecting isolated to scattered if anything uh, showers for both windward and leeward sides throughout tomorrow afternoon so not much is expected in terms of the showers tonight we're going to have a slight uptick of those windward showers and again that's going to start to ease off and dry out more as we get in through tomorrow afternoon but across all the islands particularly from the island of Molokai on Maui County here on Oahu we're looking to be about 88 degrees in terms of the high temperature wind speeds again will be around 10 up to 15 miles per hour in terms of sustained winds. So again, if you're heading outside, put on that sunscreen. And really, that's going to be the trend. Partly cloudy skies takes us all the way through the extended forecast. And trade winds, fortunately, will stick in the east early direction, but they're going to continue to ease off.